Summary. I don't know if I can just please, read this please, summary. Please, please, please. Summary. It says, the, the summary of the judgment, that some of the witnesses called by petitioners ended up supporting the case of the petition. I mean, some of the ended up supporting the case of the respondents. Yes. Because most of them did say there was no crisis at all in their polling unit. The expert witnesses purportedly called were worthless. Allegations that majority of the votes uh, not scored failed to prove two sets of scores. That is, allegation that he didn't score the majority of the votes. Mm -hmm. the, the judges, justices said you have to show the lawful votes and the unlawful votes. Then, nothing in law that mandates electronic collation or transmission. You have to show us where the law supports that. Allegation of irregularities not backed by any evidence at all, because evidence of irregularity will have to focus on the voting unit. You, in your case, votes were counted. Your agents, you didn't call any of your agents to show that at this unit where I worked, there was a problem. Allegation of rigging is vague without specifying or proving any rigging with evidence or where any rigging took place. Federal capital territory citizens cannot be accorded higher voting rights yes. in the Constitution that prescribes equality of citizens. And this is the point I was making before that federal capital is a mere nomenclature. The interests of the law are the voters. And if you understand constitutional law, voters belong to states, not to federal government. That's why federal government has to be made as if it's a state. Mm -hmm. You don't compute voters from the standpoint of federal government. You compute it from states and local government. They are the owners of voters. Therefore, you've got to make federal capital territory as if it's a state to be able to make, take con charge, compute the voters in the federal capital. And once you are doing that, Federal capital territory cannot be more than any state in terms of computing voters. Just as citizens in federal capital territory cannot have any more unequal votes than any other city. So these issues... You know, in a situation like this, it's probably not you know, unexpected that um, especially the petitioners will get up to all sorts of um, legal gymnastics. I wanted to ask you, um, uh, how knowledgeable do you think? Um, I, I saw something on social media, uh, a little, you know, those things they send that um, right. is, is this like uh, the uh, 12 to thirds uh, mm -hmm. issue? And no. I'm, I'm looking, I'm, I'm trying to see where, what, what, what does 12 to thirds, the Akhijide 12 to thirds issue, uh, what does it have to do with the judgment that was seen yesterday that was as particular as it was. So I was going to ask... Uh, is the Akinjide 12 to... First of all, we have a different constitution now, don't we? It do, I yes. think Akinjide's 12 to 12 was under the 1979 constitution. We have 1999 constitution now, and that's what we're working with. Mm -hmm. So I really don't know... So where, where that is coming that. from? It's not relevant. Yeah, at all. Uh, at, I thought relevant. so, but um, what do I know? Uh, is what all, I'm asking. I don't think it's relevant to the issue. You know what I mean? But... If we look at the issue, and this is not really not the first time this issue will. If we look at it from even the standpoint of logic, it says the federal capital territory is to be treated as if it were a state. So for purposes, for all purposes. So in essence, what he's saying is that we have 37 states for all purposes. Exactly. Now... Because you cannot, he said, it's nothing for purpose. He said, it's treated as a, as, a, as a state. We have 37 states. And it says that in that 37 states, you must have a quarter of two thirds of the states. The only reason, like I said, why federal capital territory, the word and is used, is because federal capital territory is an unequal state. You cannot treat unequals equally. Mm. It, like it, doesn't I said, have a, it doesn't have an assembly. It doesn't have a, you a cannot, state assembly yes. of its own. That's why it says, as if it is a state. If it is a state, you won't say as if it is a state. But for the purposes of computing the voters, since voters belong to states, you have to turn federal capital territory into a state, as if it is a state for the purposes of calculating. Because even in federal capital territory, you look at the various local governments in order to determine who is a senator. Mm. 